In this tutorial, we're going to talk about mechanical energy, part two. Mechanical energy. Start with potential energy. It is a stored energy. The human body energy comes from the digestion of food that transforms into chemical energy. And that is where you get your energy from. Let's take this equation. The mechanical energy is equivalent to the potential energy plus the kinetic energy. Now talking about the first branch of potential energy, and that is gravitational potential energy. Let's talk about it even more. Gravitational potential energy, GPE. In the weightlifting example given on page 143, the weightlifter has used some chemical energy to do the work. We know that energy is conserved and that is related to the exercise that we're talking about right now. And so, it is converted to heat in the weightlifter's body. The remainder has been transferred to the weight, and that is because he has increased its height in the gravitational field of the Earth. And so the energy gained is what we call GPE. Now let's talk about the equation of change for GPE, where it is formed of the mass of the object in m kilogram, multiplied by the gravitational field strength, multiplied by the distance raised against the gravitational force. And so, all of these three multiplied by each other, they would give us the change in GPE. That will be everything for this tutorial, and we will continue in the next one.